Yeah, this is my first song from New Horizons. Oh, okay, we'll leave it going then. Chill shotgun, <laughs> chill shotgun king hours. Uh, we'll do throne. Um, okay, so we're gonna be alternating between very hard mode where I need to get the next clear and easy mode where we're gonna be like doing just general cleanup on some achievements. Curious how, to, how this plays? Okay, well, um, uh, we'll go into easy mode just cause we're opting for, well, we'll warm up on easy. So basically, we only have one piece, but that piece is a shotgun, and we, uh, we blast. Okay. Force that shot. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Uh, I love vibe to be tagged with. Love it. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, so, and after you finish a round, basically you take uh, one of two sets of cards. Uh, there's a positive thing that gives you a benefit and a negative thing, which basically changes kind of the structure of the enemy lineup. Um, we got Ritual Dagger and Sacred Crown. Um, Ritual Dagger is really good, makes the king extra soft, which is good because it just means the faster you kill the king, if you get, if you, you, if you take out the king, uh, the, mat, the round ends anyway, so it's the only piece that ultimately matters, but we do have bodyguard here. King can't be killed if a knight is alive, so we have to take out all the knights now and the king. So. Yeah, but uh, yeah, so this is probably the best I've ever done at chess. There we go. Okay, group scope, uh, king's shoulders. Um, we technically need this one more, uh, but it's for this card actually, not king's shoulders. King's shoulders is okay. It lets you basically move on the same space as a piece and lift it and huck it at another piece. This is pretty good. It's pretty, pretty fun. Um, we'll do, we'll do. Yeah, I don't need, don't need. This is really good, though. Now nah, we'll do King Shoulders. Buff King. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Just like that. Yeah, that's how it's done. I love chess. Yeah. Small fire harvest is pretty handy. It basically gives us ammo back on pawn kill. Sure, it's time from first seeing a game on Steam to buying myself a copy. It, okay, so for people that don't know this game, this game was in part of a game jam like a month, month and a half ago or so. Um, and yeah, it's already on Steam. It's like seven, seven ninety nine Canadian, I think. It's very, very much worth every penny. So, um. Ammo regeneration, fire range. I'll take this one just for the extra range. Okay, we got we got a queen over here. So queens are, of course, like the most dangerous piece. But as long as we as long as we play our cards right or move our chess piece right, we'll be fine. Okay. Moat. Moat is really good. Um, we do need the moat. We actually need both these. Uh, we'll do the moat though, because the moat is like a top tier skill. Put the moat in the middle so pieces have to stop here at least once before they cross. Uh, do you like uh, chess and chess derivatives? Yes, uh, I do. We oddly enough end up playing a bunch of chess esque games. I'm gonna throw that at the queen. <laughs> Fuck it. Um, two. Yeah, there we go. Uh, we also, um, good friend of the stream, uh, good friend of the stream, uh, Cass also has a game uh, called Chess Explosion, which is Bomberman and chess together, pushed into one thing. And it has rollback net code, so it's actually, it plays really good online. Okay. Okay, so we want to be like right here. Oh, that's dangerous. Um, oh, crap. Um, okay, we're gonna use one of our souls, which lets us move like another piece. Do that. Okay. 
There we go. Yeah. Let's roll back, yes. Yeah. Taunting Hop is one we need. It stacks with Virtual Dagger. So the achievements in this game, a lot of them are tied to... Um, it's tied to collecting sets of three cards. So with this one and Ritual Dagger, we'll have a set of two. There's one more card in this set that we have to find. Um, the cards are just like RNG based on like, you know, how you'll get them or whatever. But uh, yeah, that's that's what we're going for achievement wise. Yeah. Oh, OK. Um, all dangerous. Uh, there. Okay. Yeah. But it's it's honestly it's really fun. It's it's a pretty easy going game. I say easy going. It's actually quite hard, but it's but it's very fun. Definitely has my recommendation. I like to I like to like explore games like this that uh, people might not have heard about. Uh, we'll just go for the king there. Crow's blessing. We need the belt, but I don't think it's for any sets we've even got started. So uh, we'll do crow's blessing just because fire range is really good. Makes our shots go farther. Which is especially good with moat because... Uh, there we go. go bait the queen into just moving one step yeah. okay so one of the negatives we pulled on the last one here uh secret air uh is basically um basically you one of the pawns will turn into a king and you can you don't know which one until you're like in line with them so it usually pays just to take out all the pawns. There we go. Uh, uh, high focus. We need this. This is a very, very bad one to take, though. Um, Iron Maiden is pretty, pretty mean. Um, we need this for our set, which uh, is moat. Uh, yeah, it's worth taking. I don't like Iron Maiden, though. Basically, it makes it so the queens can't die, but they have more limited movement. So sometimes it works out, sometimes it's off. Yeah, that did not look very limited, did it? Gosh, um. I'm gonna just go up here. Just trying to take up the king right away. Oh, jeez. Um, fine. There. Okay. Grave scope. High focus. Um, cavalry is not one we need. We'll do high focus. Limited. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Limited in quotation marks. Yeah. Okay, there's only four of them, so this makes this not quite so bad. Especially since I just killed two of them. Yeah, that's not so bad. Uh, subtle, subtle poison. Subtle poison stacks with taunting hop. Oh, this is a full set, so this is what we're looking for. This gives us a set with um, Ritual Dagger, um, Taunting Hop, and uh, Subtle Poison. Subtle Poison makes King the King once again have less health, only three, which is ridiculously low. We should be able to technically just shoot at the King from here. I should probably be careful though. Oh. Oops. 
Oh my goodness, is somebody back? Ooh. Oh, uh... <laughs> There's a lot of backups. Um... Gosh. Okay, now we just have to hit the king twice. Or once. There. Okay. What's up, Hive? What's up? How you doing? Oh my god, this is the second set. Is it one of Gust? Uh, two sets. Gender queer. Remove one bishop, add one queen at the start turn five. Let's try it. If we do this, we get two achievements in one go. Sent you something. What do you send me? What do you send me? Oh, very good. Oh, excellent. Oh my goodness. Ah. Oh, that's amazing. Uh, generally, Curtis celebrates Star Ruby's beautiful cosplay wedding. Wait, was sweet. Oh my gosh, that is going into the chat. Uh, cosplay wedding and... Uh, one, one of them is cosplaying as Elfeld, and the other is cosplaying as um, Squiggly. Elfeld from uh, Guilty Gear and Squiggly from uh, Skullgirls. Oh, very good. That's adorable. Oh, wow, we killed the king in like one shot. That was really fast. Okay, final floor. Elfeld got her wedding after all. Aww. <laughs> I saw that. This is so cute. It is. Oh my gosh, I didn't see this. I think I saw pictures like maybe in passing. Oh, so cute. Ah. Oh, that's adorable. That's very adorable. Oh. All right. Oh, I'm so pleased for them. OK, so we're going to just we're going to take out the big king. And I think we're not going to have too much trouble because they couldn't get to me. <laughs> so that's, a two, that's two achievements in one go, which is awesome because it's really hard to get even one set sometimes. We got assassin and social distancing sets. So we did it. Uh, uh, that puts us at what? 56%. Uh, just going to like adjust this. Where is Shotgun King? Shotgun King. So 56%. Oh, <laughs> a whole bunch of redeems all at once. So <laughs> it like caused my like You're pretty good. Yeah. How y'all doing? <laughs> so that was that was a single clear and easy mode. Uh, pretty good. So let's try a very hard mode. So very hard mode, the difference is, is it adds one pawn, adds one knight to the starting lineup. You get one less charge in the shotgun, so you only get to shoot one shell before you have to move. Um, uh, and it removes one soul slot, which means that it's going to be a lot harder. <laughs> uh, aw, thank you. Aw, thank you. Okay. Because of these ones, I'm not going to try for achievements. I'm just going to go for what I think is going to be ultimately the best setup. So, um, there we go. So we're, we're oh, fuck. <laughs> so what I was going to say is we're going to play to win. <laughs> but yeah, um, first round's data. Yeah. Destroy. <laughs> yeah. No question of that. Oh my gosh. Um. There we go. Okay. It's a lot scarier when you don't have as much ammo. <laughs> Bag is hurting from all the packing today. Oh gosh. Yeah, gotta be very, very careful with that. It's a lot. Or I'm gonna be a creaky old lady. Oh. Yeah. Hopefully, hopefully it won't be as bad as what you think it will be. Uh, definitely take some, definitely take some um, 
like ibuprofen or whatever like take take some pills for it ahead of the time ahead of time because like if you let the pain get ahead of you it might be pretty bad uh, so I think I just got pinned. <laughs> we can... <sighs> nope, we're pinned. And we can't do more than five damage, so we lost. That was dumb on my part. Yeah. Yeah. Get me in there. Put me in, coach. I got this. Oh, wow. <laughs> All the pellets just went in one direction. I'm not particularly good at chess, and as I've learned, I'm very bad at seeing things in diagonals, so that's also a factor. God, I gotta like, I gotta get back and play like Skullgirls again. Especially with all the updates lately. There, okay. Round one. Oh, the mode is a really good pull, especially this early. Okay, that'll help a lot because that means that pieces can't cross like and get to us right away. Oh, that's a bad shot. Ouch. Um. Okay. I think we might be toast on this one. Shoot. <laughs> yeah. We banked it all in like one shot, and yeah, because there's nothing we can do here. Three, two, one, yeah. Go, go. yeah. We banked it on one shot, and when we didn't get anything, yeah, it it was it was a big loss. Ouch. All right. You gotta be careful about doing that sort of thing. it up a lot. I find like once you get a couple abilities, it's not so bad. I mean, speaking of Skull, you see the new character trailer? Yes, Delilah. Uh, she looks good. Uh, honestly, she's kind of my type of character, so I'm kind of kind of really about it. Even though even though I don't know if I really care that much for her design, uh, I just she's very cool. I like characters that have like grenades and kind of like um like dynamic projectiles if you know what I mean hey code when you're talking about being a fan of a game without having to play the game yes uh, what about that yeah that was a topic we had we were talking about earlier there we go okay uh, fan uh fan work only fans yeah that's yeah that's a legit thing well it's been normalized good good um, we'll just, we'll just do gunpowder. Actually, more pawns is actually kind of a good thing sometimes because the pawns block the more mobile pieces. So, not, not bad. Oh. Uh, 
Okay, this is bad. I didn't really think that one through far enough. Oh, uh, we can maybe make this work. Nice. <laughs> uh, okay, Slime Fox and Pemin did an exhibition Black Delilah at Combo Breaker. Really? Okay, I didn't see that. Might have to check that out. Um, some firepower. Yeah, more firepower is good. Dumb move, I should have shot. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Because now we have enough firepower that we can actually take out some of these things in just like single shots, which is really helpful. footing on this one now um more ammo we'll do we'll do royal low first this lets you basically shoot and move at the same time which you'd think would be like really broken but it's actually it's it's good don't get me wrong it is good but it's like not as broken as it sounds Jeez, there's a queen there. Um, <laughs> oh, jeez. Wow, that was a bad piece to have dropped in on the exact corner. <laughs> I think I'm toast. I think that was it. That's super unfortunate. Because <laughs> I can't go up that way. I can't do anything in that row. I can't do anything in this row. I can't do anything in that row. That was rude. That was really fucking rude. Ouch. Ow. <laughs> what a terrible piece. <laughs> yeah. What, what a terrible night for a rook invasion. Ugh, there we go. Powder. It's just more power. This allows us to take a, like, rooks in one shot, for example. It's pretty good. That could have been better. That was me trying to split the difference, so that was really on me. Like, I can't shoot this because otherwise the rook is gonna get me. There. Okay. Hanging, hanging tight. There. Okay. The round down. Um, extra barrel would be good. It gives two charges, so that'll be more like playing a standard game rather than what I have been playing. like just a good couple like the first couple skills if I can get a couple good ones like I'll be fine but it's just like getting those initial skills wow that was a bad shot that was in kind of a bad place um three 
Oh, fuck. I'm taking, I'm taking really risky, making risky moves, which is bad on my part. Wow. Where did all these, oh yeah, the pawns. Fair, fair. <laughs> oh, dang, unfortunate. Dang. Rude. Okay. You'll have to link me to the exhibition match with uh with Sonic Fox and uh Doom Black Delilah, because I'd be interested to see that. But no, she's like kind of my type of character because I like kind of gadgety style characters, so me some give me some weird projectiles and some like weird disjointed hitboxes and I'm in there we go 100 bus plus two firepower but it really spreads it out I'll go for it Which honestly, like, I never thought much about Blunderbuss initially, but then like once I started like playing on the higher difficulties, it's like, oh, Blunderbuss is quite good because like, it's literally two power. It's two power, and if you're point blank range, the arc doesn't even matter because you're just gonna do that much damage anyways. There. Uh, a dolphin is a pretty weird projectile. No, a dolphin is not a weird projectile. Dolphin is a sea mammal. Yeah. Or something. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Damn it, May. Um. Yeah, I'll do this. It's just more firepower. I'll take it. Oops. I missed click. Yeah, this is a little scary. Oh, dang. I pinned myself there, didn't I? Shit. Jeez, I put myself in fucking checkmate just like that. Damn. That's rough. Uh, fun fact, them's fighting herds uh, is coming to console. Oh, that's good. I think I heard that in passing. Oh, that's good. That's that's a like that's a very like underrated fighting game. Um, a little bit I played of it was it was good, solid. I know it's like the Skullgirls engine and stuff, so it's like it's a okay. Although it's kind of funny because you can definitely like feel it a little bit where it's like it, it's definitely like an engine that like I don't know it's just like I enjoy like usually I'm not crazy with tag fighters but it's like that explains why it runs super well on Mac that, would, yeah, that probably would explain why um it uh it does make me immediately like crave playing Skullgirls so whenever I play it the game doesn't even like feel that much like Skullgirls, but it's just like, I don't know. Don't tell me I fucking pinned myself again. Holy shit. These rooks are doing me in tonight. Rude. <laughs> Ew. Yeah. Okay, we're going to... Between moves? Nope. 
Uh, grenades. <laughs> Woo! Let's gamble. Oh my god. Bomb. Well, that seems to be working really well. Blast them. Let's go. Uh, see what I say. Weird, quirky projectiles. I'm about them. <laughs> um, extra barrel. We need the extra shots. It makes a big difference. Yeah, whatever. gonna play it safe and actually work on taking oh oh I really should be looking at my negatives because <laughs> this is starting to bite me in the ass Ugh. okay there took Bailey to Citrix room and sat there waiting like a parent at the park <laughs> oh my god wonder bus Where's it gonna go? Nowhere's useful. Cool. It's pretty good. Ah, uh, that was my last two shells. Oh my. Yeah. game. Um, uh, maybe not. No. Oof, that was close. There. Okay. Taunting hop. Uh, jump over nearby pieces. Uh, plus one max ammo at one uh, soul slot. Yes. And more pawns, which is actually a good thing. So... And remove the bishop also, which is like, even though it's technically like a negative, it's kind of really good for us because the more pawns the, that they have to dig through, the better for us. Aw, oh, ear wiggles. Uh, I'll get to them in just one moment. Oh. this to jump up that way. Oh, crap. Oh, wow, we need more than one damage on that. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah. Also need more damage than that. Uh, that's that's game. It's unfortunate. Yeah, pinned. Uh. <laughs> oh, I could have threw a grenade, but I don't know if. Oh no, I couldn't have. I need shells for it. Infernal. Actually, I don't know. It doesn't draw from your loaded pool, does it? Yeah, almost had it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, Infernal, how's this going? There we go. There we go. Yeah. 
Oh my goodness, this cheeseburger. Everybody's favorite cheese frog. Yeah. Like there. <laughs> Just immediately cheeseburger cheeseburger emotes. Yes, earwiggle, thank you. Thank you for the reminder. There you go. Now you get to enjoy an earwiggle with cheeseburger. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, I also got this. Ara ara, meow. <laughs> hey Paige, how you doing? I still get very confused when it's nighttime and you're streaming. <laughs> no. Yeah, I suppose it's 7.30 in the morning now. It's pretty late. You're bored. I see. It's fair. Uh -huh. There we go. <laughs> yeah, now I want to get cheeseburger. Fair. Cheeseburger is very good. Yeah. Oh my god, that <laughs> it works surprisingly well together. I love it. Cutie wiggles and cheeseburger. Oh, thank you, orange juice. <laughs> uh, plus two firing range. We want the extra shell. This kind of negates one of the worst parts of um, very hard mode, so the obvious pull. Ha! Great shot. That's dangerous. Case in point. Fuck. There. Okay. That was a little, little, little scary. Um, we could do another barrel. Sure. Or. Okay. Oh, that's a terrible thing for that to be promoted to. Uh, we need to do a lot of, a lot of killing if we want to. Oh, jeez. That's that's game. Damn it. Hard mode. Very hard mode. So hard. <laughs> okay, one more, one more, and then I'm gonna call it. Cause it's been nine and a half hours. Nine hours and twenty minutes. This is gonna be the one though. I feel it. Oh. What? No. Oh. Why? Why? <laughs> what did I do? What did I do to deserve this? stream no <laughs> not like this uh ugh, i hate both these these are both really bad i really don't want either of these they suck i'll take this one it's slightly less slightly less um bad oh thank you <laughs> safe and actually take out these ones there that'll that'll at least guarantee a win 
unless I do something dumb like that. Uh, King's shoulders. Play an extra turn when you kill a knight. Uh, we'll do this. There's two pawns, that's one rook. I don't... Ideally, we don't want to be fighting a lot of rooks, but... Survived. Yeah, that's bad. <laughs> I could have seen that one coming. Oh, okay. When I said one more, I meant like one more once. One more. One more. Okay. Hey, Luna. How you doing? Good morning. What? No. No. I'm like, no. <laughs> End stream. <laughs> okay. Going to. This is the last one, though. I swear. There. I think you're being gleaned. Oh god, these aren't good either. Um, weaker rooks though is pretty decent. Oh, the other one was plus two firepower on the corners, I think, or on the edges, which also isn't bad. There we go. Extra turn because. We... There we go. Oh, sister Tenebrae, thank you. Thank you for the sub. Oh, much appreciated. Oh, um, we're gonna take that out. King has like a little bit of health, not like a lot. Oh, oh, that really needed to do three damage. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, three. There. Okay. We're still in. We're still in there. Four. Don't do that. There. Three. Congrats on uh, getting it running. Huh? Doesn't have any audio or multiplayer yet, but it's still... Oh, hey, nice! Nice, Cass! You got it running, nice! I got my Switch port working... Hey, congratulations! Yeah. Alright. We still get two achievements in one run earlier, so I can't really can't really feel too bad about that. <laughs> Anyways, so how's everybody doing? Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's a good time to call it, I think. Oh, thank you for the head pat. So once again, for anyone that has, you know, uh, has enjoyed the stream and wants to catch me another time, uh, you can find me on Twitter and on Discord. I have a schedule up on both. Aww. Um, yeah. You have a good night, okay, Orange Juice? It was nice meeting you. <laughs> Thank you again for the sub. Much appreciated. Um, so I'm off tonight. I'm not streaming Tuesday night. I will be back Wednesday and we're going to probably be focusing on. I'm like, what the hell is on my what is my schedule on Wednesday? I don't even know. Uh, 
Ara ara. No. <laughs> Let me see. What is my schedule on Wednesday? What is it? What what is it? it um, it says floppy nights. Uh, Sukuna. Right. We're gonna be doing Sukuna on uh Wednesday. We'll be doing Heart Space Shipbreaker. So, uh, Egg Protection plays. I'm excited. Ah, oh, that's what I needed earlier in Shipbreaker. Neck protection plates. Because the blue must have loved twice. I mean, it happens. Live and learn. Blech. Or well, I guess maybe not so much. Uh. <laughs> All right. Yeah. But um, so yeah, we're going to be doing some Sukuna on Wednesday. Probably a little bit more floppy nights and um, more shipbreaker. So it should be a pretty standard night. But yeah, I hope everybody enjoyed tonight's stream. We got floppy nights in, a little bit of drawing time. Uh, so we took apart two ships in hard space and we got two achievements in chest explosion. So I feel pretty good about all that. All right. So let's take a look. Let's see who. Um, let's see if we can't find a uh, find a good raid. Okay, we got we got Gunella streaming Resident Evil 2, which would be pretty good. We got Wifey streaming Sekiro, which is also pretty good. Uh, Syncret is doing just chatting. Punk is doing a game called Lemon Cake, apparently. Ada's doing uh, Dicey Dungeons. That could be a really good raid. Ada, Ada is wonderful, so yeah. Um, uh, but just spent most of yesterday shipping metal in my friend's sword smithy. Oh, exciting. Doing some smithing? Uh, I really wish I could get into that kind of gig full time. Gotcha. I don't know anything. I don't know anything about, um, about like what it takes to like do like work in a like forge. Um, I'll just take a quick look here. Yeah, we raided Goon Yellow just the other night. We actually raided Aqua Punk the other night too. Um, Ada just started, so hour and four, hour and fifty minutes. That's a good sign. Oh, I, we raided Aqua Punk doing lemon cake before too. Look cute. All right, but I think Ada. We'll send the raid to Ada. Although, probably going forward, I should probably start looking into raiding a few new people, throwing throwing some raids in some random directions, see see how that can shake out. Yeah. So we're gonna do we're gonna raid uh, Ada. Yeah. He's doing dicey dungeons, and dicey dungeons is excellent. So, yeah, and Ada is excellent, so it's perfect. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to call it for now. Um, thank you all for watching, hanging out tonight. Hope everybody enjoyed the stream. Thank you again, everyone, for the raids and the subs and everything. Just all the support. I appreciate it. And yeah, I will be back Wednesday night uh, with some more stuff. And yeah, I will catch you all later. Show Ada some love and everybody have a good night and a good day. Yeah, bye. <laughs>